Jolly Green Giant. So he did every commercial for them. It was the man, the real man. They would paint him green, put the little leaves, you know, <laughs> down here to cover up everything. And then he would come home from shooting his commercials and he'd wrestle with us kids and call us his little sprouts. So that was so cute. I mean, growing up with that, I mean, my dad, I thought, was just like a hero. And so that was kind of cute. And then he passed away. He had cancer and he passed away. And they start, stopped doing the commercials. They just did cartoon character. But he was a Jolly Green Giant. So I grew up in that. I did commercials with the family when I was younger or by myself. I did print work. I didn't like it when I was a kid. I would rather be outside playing. And then when I grew up, I got my first film. And it was kind of like I was in the right place at the right time. I wasn't looking for this part. And I was going out with the guy who got the lead role, and the producer saw us together. And she played the lead girl. And this was Skate Town USA. I was 17 years old. Patrick Swayze played my brother. That was his first film as well. And he was incredible. And that kind of started my. Uh, movie, TV career from there, then on. And then I thought, oh, this is easy. I can go out and get every part I want. <laughs> and then, of course, it didn't work out that way. I think it took months, maybe even a year to get another part. Maybe not a year, but it just felt like it because you're out there just pounding the cement. You're going to this interview, that interview. And back then, it was different. You'd go in and meet producers and meet the people. Now you send in tapes, which is really weird. But um, 